Well, good morning, good morning, good morning, everybody. Happy hump day. It's Wednesday. We are the Woofer Walkers Doggy Services out of Richmond, British Columbia, Canada. And we've got a bunch of cute woofers here today. All kinds of lovely woofers. We're right now I'm hanging out with the smaller woofers. Well, Eddie's not so small. Eddie's not so small, but he's a he's small dog friendly. So he's allowed to hang out with the littles. And same with Grandpa Lolo. Grandpa Lolo is allowed to hang out with the littles too. Because he's a gentle, sweet, yeah, an older man, gentleman. Aren't you, Lolo? I love you, Lolo. You got goobies in your eyes. There we go. Hi. So Lolo is one of our sanctuary rescue woofers. He lives with us, and he's going to live with us forever and ever. <laughs> Aren't you, Lolo? He's probably about 16 now, I think. 15 or 16. Hi, Zeke. Hi. This is Zeke. Zeke is here on vi oh. <laughs> Zeke is here on vacation. Zeke is um, Zeke's one of our. Um, we take him on woofer walks. Woofer walks are um, pack walks. We call them woofer walks. Oh, what's the matter, Eddie? Oh, is poor Jack stuck? This <laughs> this is Jack's, and I think he's stuck and he can't get in the little dog daycare because he's a little bit too wide for that. There we go. <laughs> we got a little door here into the small dog daycare, the VIP we call it. Very important petite room, VIP room. And uh, usually the rule is if you can fit through the little door, then you're allowed in, but <clears throat> there are exceptions. <laughs> Jax is allowed in here because he's actually technically a smaller breed. He just can't fit through the little dog door, so. Where's that ball? There was a blue ball somewhere. Jax loves to play ball. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. So Jax is a French a French bulldog. Oh, Chloe let go of Cholula's collar. <laughs> Jax is having a lot of fun, actually. He's a real playful guy. <clears throat> you are too big to, you're too big, you're too big. You are too big, no. You're too big for the little woofer thing. Come on, you go play with the big kids. Eddie's trying to get into the v VIP. And he, can you let him up or something? He doesn't have a wristband to get into the VIP. <laughs> you don't have a wristband. Ah, 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 he's so mad at me. He's giving, oh, this is, you're beating up the bouncer. You're beating up the bouncer. You're never gonna get into the VIP if you beat up the bouncer. Oh my goodness, sassing me up. You sassing me? Yeah? Yeah, you can go play with the big kids. It's a beautiful day, by the way. Look at the sunshine we got, yeah! It's weird though, because we just got dumped on by snow, which was really weird, like the day before March 1st. Thankfully, the sun came back and it's all slushy and going away. You guys should put up those lovely tiki umbrellas we have for our... Oh, is it? It's too windy? Oh, okay. Oh, this is Peanut. Hi, Peanut. He's, he's basking in the sunshine. Basking in the sunshine. Hi, Peanut. Oh, hello. Peanut is a Chihuahua mix and Dachshund and something else. Yeah, a Chihuini, a Chihuini, Chihuahua wiener dog. So nice to have some sunshine. This is Leo. This is Leo. He also is one of our rescue wolfers here that lives at our sanctuary. I don't know what he is, but we figure probably some kind of Shiba mix. There's Cholula. Cholula is, um, <clears throat> where is she? Where'd she go? Where's Cholula? There she is. She's a Chihuahua from Mexico. She also is our latest rescue here at the sanctuary. And this is Chloe. She's not a rescue, but she is our, she is Chihuahua. She was Cholula's best friend. 
She's a little Westie doodle. So a West Highland White Terrier mixed with a poodle. I don't know where she went. This is Ollie. Ollie Ogilvy. Hi, Ollie Ogilvy. Hi. Hi, buddy. He's here for doggy daycare. This is Angus. He's my Pomeranian. And here's Moxie, my other Pomeranian. We got all the big kids up on the deck right now. Hello, big kids. Such a beautiful day. Oh, this is Echo. Echo's learning how to be social. She used to have some social anxiety, so she has to wear a muzzle because just for probably the next couple of months, just because she, um, hello, Poppy, just so that we can make sure she, everybody is safe while she's learning to socialize. She's a beautiful girl. She's a, <clears throat> I think she's a seven-year-old German Shepherd. This is Poppy. Poppy is here for daycare and Titan is here for daycare. Titan is a Leonberger, another big breed. Look at him, we call him the kissing bandit. Cause he wants to kiss everyone. Uh, Poppy is a St. Bernard mixed with a Bernese mountain dog. That's why she's so big. We've got the regulars up there like Scout. Scout. Oh, and Franklin. Oops, it went blurry. Franklin is the biggest woofer here. He is a Newfoundlander. He's here actually on vacation right now, hanging out at the doggy daycare because he's on vacay with his sister from another Mr. Molly. I don't know where she is. She's up there somewhere. Another Newfie. And that's Vader the Shepherd here for doggy daycare. And there's Eddie again on vacation. And there's little Max back there for doggy daycare. That's Max. There's Maxie. Ooh. Oh, and Kuma's here for doggy daycare. Hi, Kuma. There's Max. Hi, Max. Hi, Kuma. Kuma is a Shepherd and Malinois, we, we guess. And Max, we think, is a Husky cross of some sort. Both here for doggy daycare. Did I miss anyone? I don't think so. I think I got y'all. I got Scout. <gasps> Chara is one of our rescue woofers from uh, Thailand, rescue from the meat trade there by Soy Dog Foundation. Same with Chara there. Also a meat trade rescue. Why does my phone do this? Oh, there she is. Um, Soy Dog, S O I, they rescue dogs from the illegal dog meat trade in Thailand and other places. Oh, if you'd like some more information about Soy Dog and how you can help them, um, please please send us a, a message and we'll help, we'll help you get information. See, I told you these two are best friends. <laughs> Looks like um, Jax wants to get involved. He finally came outside. I'm wondering if I should put his jacket on. If he stays active, he may not need it on, but if he's just standing around, he may need a jacket because <clears throat> his mummy told us that he gets cold pretty easy. I think we will put a jacket on him. I'll go get a jacket in a minute. There's Angus. I think I already said Angus, my black palm. Hi. We also call him the Babadook. Hi, Angus. And Harry, for obvious reasons. Are you Harry? He's beautiful. He's such a handsome, handsome boy. Hello. Isn't he fabulous? You're fabulous. There's my other little palm, Andy. Hi, Andy. Call him Andy Lion because he kind of looks like a dandelion when he's not wearing a, a shirt. Oh, you guys, you can tell that spring's around the corner because the girls are starting to lie around in the sun. Chara. Oh yeah, and there's Charlie. He's a rescue from the meat trade in Korea. Hi, Charlie. Hi, buddy. I love you. And Zeke, the black and white, here for doggy daycare. Uh, we think he's probably an Eskimo mixed with a Border Collie or an Aussie. Chara, why are you barking? 
looking at Woofer Lodge for Marina. Weird. You just noticed her now? She's been here all morning. Hi, guys. So, yeah, that's, uh, that is our Wednesday so far. That's our Wednesday. <laughs> Get her! Get her! <laughs> I'm going to put a jacket on, um, on uh, Jax and myself so that we can go outside and not get cold. <laughs>